I don't know what. If you were as desperate as me, you'd wear this hair covering too, okay? Like, really, you would. Um. I can't believe that they predicted even that I would wear this. Uh, also, what the fuck is this shit? What is this? Why Why is this here? Has this been here the whole time? What the fuck is that? Uh, this shit sucks. I gotta <laughs> Oh, why does that sound so bad? Did it always sound... Does it always sound like that? Okay. I love how I'm just announcing that. Oh, my music sounds so awful. And I love how I'm just announcing the fact that Sherman and Peter pooped on the floor. That's amazing. Uh, my videos are just top notch. The, the shitty thing about it is that she's not even that into me. She says she's into me, but she's not even into me. I keep her up all night, but she likes the fact that I keep her up all night. Just because she could go... Uh, go fuck guys and stuff. She doesn't actually even like me at all. It's terrible. You won't. You don't even know how terrible it is. And God, I'm so fucking like, I, like, ugh. I can't. I cannot even move. I'm so fucking just. Ugh.
just like I can barely stand or move at all. This shit sucks so bad. No access to the rest of the house at all. really don't feel like carrying gallons of water back and forth. Back and forth to my house. It's all I got, and I give you some, okay? I give you a little of everything that I have. And if it's not good enough, I don't know what to tell you. I don't, I don't know what to tell myself. Seriously, is me talking about Christianity and God for an hour really that big of a deal? Like people do. Why do people hate that shit so much? I don't understand why people hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it. Like it's like one, it's like one thing. Like they don't like it, or they think it's weird, or like whatever. But like they hate it. They absolutely hate it for some reason. Like I just don't understand why they hate it so much. Facts are facts, guys. The reason why God has the shape of a man is because God was a man. He wasn't a God at all. He was just a man and a, maybe a creator. But that's, that's it. End of story. That's the, that's the Cliff Notes version. an old black dude. Black beard dude. And, uh, beardless ones and pretty much every bearded one. Not, not necessarily all of them are his creations. You know you know, created, arranged by his genetic engineering. Genetic engineering, which could simply have been breeding people for the right people that he wanted. Like, pick just, not just selection. No, like, you know, replacing the genes of whatever with whatever kind of vi using viral DNA to replace genes and all this kind of stuff. Like, maybe they did that too, but I I honestly, I'm not really convinced that that's even possible. I know that's like how the, how the vaccine's supposed to work and stuff, but I'm not, I'm not convinced that it does anything. Like, I don't, I don't think that it's, I don't necessarily, I don't think that it's like poison either, because tons of people have got it, supposedly, and it's possible they're all lying and they didn't really get it. But I mean, I'm assuming that those people aren't lying, and they did really get it. 
and then it did nothing. And then it does nothing to anyone. And that you're not missing out on anything by not getting it, and you're not getting anything by getting it. Because I'm pretty sure that all of this talk, that vaccinations, like all of this talk about the, like I'm pretty sure it's all just, just it's all just uh, hype. That it's all just hype. Every bit of it is just hype. Like, all of it. The virus, the vaccine, all of it is hype. Just manufactured. Just period. Just whole cloth manufactured to get people hysterical, sell them masks, sell them vaccines. And that all of it is nothing. And even the vaccine doesn't do anything. And, and the virus itself is nothing. You know, I, that's what that's what I think. I think that it's all fake, but it's possible that one or the other could be fake. I I don't really know. It's possible the vaccine really does do gene, gene modification, and it's to try to protect a certain group of people from a certain uh, fate, and that that's why everyone gets it and recommends you get it and stuff. It could be that the gene modification shit is real. I don't know, though, guys. That just seems so fucking science fiction to me. Like, I have never seen any evidence that that, that, that shit is real. I've never seen, like, gene genetically modified. Like, anything bizarre. Like, where they took the genes of, like... Even just, like, with plants or something. And they took the genes of some two wholly unrelated plants and, like, grew some totally new, different plant that was, like, some chimera kind of plant that's, like, totally totally, totally distinct, could not have been produced otherwise without genetic modification. Like, I have not seen anything like that ever in my life. If I saw something like that, I like, or, like, with an animal, like, with a test, like, a lab rat or something, like, I'd be like, yeah, maybe the genetic modification thing is real. And they can use viral DNA to modify genes and stuff like that. I'd be like, yeah, now that I see the plant that also has a cat head. Yeah, you know, I kind of buy it. But, like, until I see something like that, like, I'm, I'm pretty much not going to buy it. I pretty much think that it's fake. Because I think probably most of genetic testing is fake. Or at least very unreliable. Filled with misinformation, disinformation, lies. That's just my opinion, though. I don't. I don't actually know. I, I'll tell. I'm first off to tell you. I just don't know. Straight up, first off to tell you. I just don't know. Supposedly, talking about the vaccine is a big no-no. Talking about the vaccine and the virus like I am is a big no-no. But it's not, I'm just, it's just, it's just straight skepticism, guys. Just, that's all, that's all it is. It's just straight skepticism. I just don't know. Not, I haven't, like, they were like, trust science. I'm like, what science? What science am I supposed to be trusting, guys? Like, what are you talking about? Like, what science at all am I supposed to trust? I have not seen any science on this stuff. Any evidence that this shit exists. I have no fucking idea. Like, guys, herpes is not, is not, maybe it's caused by, like, herpes and genetic, and her, herpes, like, I, I don't know. Maybe it's herpes is a virus, is a virus not convinced that it is I think that herpes is caused by malnutrition I'm pretty sure that herpes is caused by malnutrition which can be created with by certain lifestyles too and not just from not eating like, a, like certain lifestyles cause health problems. 
you know? Certain lifestyles cause health problems. Because believe it or not, like, just wasting a bunch of birth, like a, birth, a bunch of birth material, like a bunch of, like, sperm, and, or like having, you know, abortions, that's bad for your body. You might not know this, guys, but that's hard on your body. It's bad for your body. It might not be obvious to you men and women out there that, you know, you're not, you know, that that, that baby in your body, that, I've heard lots of women be like, actually, until you give birth to it, it's just like a parasite that just steals your, no, it's, it's, it's a part of your body, and then when you go in and like violently remove it, your body has to heal from that. It has to use, you know, it has to get other fucking nutrition. Like, when your uterine lining gets ripped out and shit like that, that your body has to work to replace that stuff. All women know they have to take iron supplements and stuff like that around their period. Because if they don't, they'll, like... They get really super anemic and, like, fall over and stuff from blood loss. And it's crazy. It's crazy. You know, it's really hard to believe that Mr. Garrison could have been right about something, right? Right? It's crazy to believe that. But, uh... I don't know, guys. I mean, maybe you can... Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he's wrong about that. I shouldn't say I don't know about the, you know if he's right at all. But I mean, it's possible. You know, you really just can't trust anybody. Nobody, because everyone is susceptible to manipulation, and that anyone, any point in time, can manipulate people you love into hurting you. And that there's, that it's just people are just open boxes. And anyone with the ill intention enough to get someone you love to hurt you can do it. You know? That people are just open books and there's nothing we can do about that. It's possible. salt and amino acids in this ramen packet combined with some water will allow me to move around comfortably. It's a good chance that I'll leave the house tonight. It's a good chance. Good chance anyways. Um I, it is so pissing me off that, that, that it won't stop. It won't stop pausing. It won't stop pausing my Twitch streams. Like, it's not an accident. It's annoying. They're ruining my videos on purpose. And this is what happens when you mess with the police. They didn't mess with you at all. I just live in my mom's house and don't have a job. Or, you know, a job where I stand on my feet for fucking hours a day. Because that's what they want. They want me to stand on my feet for hours a day and stay, keep my back straight and, like, all this crazy kind of shit. And I have no idea why they want me to do that. Some ideas. I've heard rumors of why they might want me to do that, but I actually don't know. I think that it's insane. I think that it's absolutely fucking insane. 
I think it's insane, and that they should stop. Because I don't think there's any good reason. I think they should just leave me alone. Leave me and everyone alone. And people can be like... Fact, matter of fact is, is that I am not a giant, guys. Any point in time that I could have been a giant is long gone. <coughs> I don't believe necessarily that there ever were giants. I think they're just people who are like... a foot taller than me. I don't think they were like literal giants. Who were big enough to like move megalithic rocks and shit like that. I don't, I don't think that that's true. Maybe, maybe two hundred thousand years ago, they, they, it was it was like that. I don't think so, though. I don't think there. I mean, I mean there were pro they, you know, there were bigger ones. There definitely were bigger hominids who were like significantly bigger. I mean, it's possible. Am I related to them at all? Uh, maybe extremely distantly. Who the fuck knows? I don't think it really matters. talking about people who've been bred and bred and bred to be completely different than that. You know what I mean? So... Who gives a shit, right? It mostly tastes sugar. It mostly tastes like sugary and salty to me. Occasional hunk of like garlic or something. Also, I saw someplace somewhere where, like, a next to your shower, you know, like, you know, you have your shower, your shower head with the, with the rains, and then next to your shower, there's, like, a douche nozzle, and it's, like, a hose is connected to, like, you know, like a penis-type shape, and you're, you can stick it up your, uh, your orifices and spray them out. And I saw this someplace. I can't recall where. And, uh... I don't know what. Have you guys seen that? Somebody tell me. Nobody's gonna very nice answer my questions. Nobody will respond to me. I just wonder, like, did I see that in real life, or was this like an alternate timeline or some shit like that? You guys, you, have you guys seen this? Certainly this must exist someplace.
just like I don't know. The indigenous peoples like don't even wonder how they got to where they are. You know. Not uh, not enough. That's for damn sure. they don't care. And the history just doesn't matter to them. Which, oh my god. It, it might be something to learn from, guys. It might be something to learn from there. There might be some lessons to take away and learn from history. Just, just maybe. I'm pretty sure I swim in the blood. In the... In the bloodline. And that I can be literally anyone I want to. At any point in time. Not anyone. But... You know. Mostly anyone. I ran into some difficulties with that in the past. But, uh... Um, you know, it's complicated. Uh... But... You know, uh... It could be, uh... You know, because of jaw or whatever. He's possibly really mightier than me. And he might be the guy that everyone says yes to. He says yes to everything and everyone says yes to it. And, you know, uh... That guy? Anybody ever considered, uh... You know, maybe consider not fucking that guy. Yeah, well, if you were in front of him, you'd fucking do. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Still. Oh my god. That shit is insidious and, like, dare I say, evil? Instincts. I trusted my instincts. You know, guys. And I didn't realize. I didn't have my memory. And I didn't realize that my instincts are training. Trained into me. Bred into me. Over.
my instincts are wrong. So I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have gone straight. Like, like I went straight for. I went straight for Ja. I went straight for him because I'm stupid. You know, I went. Sh you know, not. You should say. I should say straight. Straight. You know. Ha ha ha. But you know. You know what I mean. Picked, I I picked wrong there. I picked wrong there. My first instinct was wrong. I mean, we're drawn to each other. We're drawn to each other. Only he knows, he knew better. And I didn't. Okay? Because it's hard for you to believe this, guys. But he's actually older than me. I've said, I, and I wrote this, I, I wrote this online already, but that dude is older than me. Okay, that's why the lady calls me a grave robber. Because... I'm not a cradle robber. I'm a grave robber. Guys, it's hard for people to understand this stuff. I already said this. I already said this shit on my... You know, we're both... We're both really, really old. We're both really, really old. I mean, maybe I'm older than him. I, you know, I mean, but, you know, I don't... I didn't remember any of that shit. You know? I don't... I didn't remember being older than him. I had no idea of being older than him. I'm not convinced that I am. I think that he's older than me, because I think he spent more time in, he spent more time in the sun than me. And I think that makes him older than me. You know, time is a wacky, wacky kind of thing, you know? It's a wacky... When you're in an infinite time loop, time is wacky and weird. Especially in the dream world. Time's wacky and weird. So get, get off my ass, people. Get off my fucking ass. Leave me alone. And it's possible, even though I've been locked in here, it's possible that I've been given a little, that, I, that people have been respected, respecting some of my boundaries, which is crazy to me. The whole time, and I just didn't know.
Yes. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Muhammad was told by an angel to write stuff down, and he did. The Torah was written by eyewitnesses.
hate that I keep getting more followers and my follower number doesn't go up. I hate that. Elbows hurt really bad for some reason. I have no explanation why. You think it's just from leaning on them like this for a long time? Could be.
yes, 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 yes. You guys like that? I'm tweeting. I'm live tweeting, guys. YouTube is just being my main. <laughs> 